welcome back to my channel. My name is Maria, but you can call me M. And for those who are new to my channel, welcome. And I make vlog videos, luxury hauls, and today we are gonna be doing a haul. And it is the stuff that my mom got me when she went to the Philippines and Japan. Um, January, late January, early February time. I know it's April and it's just, it's been forever. So let's get started. So first, we're gonna do this haul from Ideal Vision. And this is where I get my contacts from, my colored contacts from. And we have four boxes of Fresh Look contacts, but Fresh Look color blends. And they're um, Pure Hazel and Brown. So we have four of those, and these other ones are just the brown ones, so yay! And then we also have two um, all solutions, but I usually don't use these solutions. I use Optic Free from Target or any drugstore. Um, I just don't feel comfortable using a solution from the Philippines, but it's just me being picky. I'm sure it's fine, but... Yeah, and then I also have a total of four um, boxes from Air Optics colors. These are also from Fresh Look, and they're brown and pure hazel as well. So this is just what they look like. And lastly, from this bag, it's not from this store, um, my mom got me a mobile phone ring stent. So this is what it looks like. And she got it for 100 pesos. Moving on to clothing. So she got me a scarf. This scarf from Mango. And this was for 995 pesos. So yep, that's that. This one is also from Mango. And it was on sale from $14.95 to $7.95. That's pretty good. This is a thick scarf. I love to take this with me when I'm traveling. It's pretty good. And then from Japan, she got me the Midori Superfine Yukata, which is a kimono. So this is what it looks like. And it was 9,800 yen. 9800 yen, pretty expensive. So, thanks, mama. And then she also got me from Uniqlo a lounge set. I love to wear this always, like always, always, always. So that one is that. And another scarf from Mango from 9.95 to 5.95. So that's what it is. It's just a purple scarf. It's thick. Another great one for travel. And then my cousins got me some chicharrias. So they're like chips from the Philippines. And I have two full, two bags of these full of chicharrias. Sorry you can see my light. Like this is a new setup and it's actually kind of bothering me that the reflection is there, but it's okay. If it doesn't bother you guys, it's fine with me. So, I'm trying to block it with my head. So we have, I'm gonna have it next to me. Potato chips, some fish crackers. This migori is not from the Philippines. This is from California when I went. And I've been wanting um, to try this, but I haven't yet. I opened the package, but I haven't tried it. Um, I have a few Chiapas chips um, in cheese flavor, roller coaster, chippy in the barbecue, V-cup potato chips. This is actually the first time I'm seeing all of this. It's been sitting in the garage downstairs. And then we have Chick Boy Pop Nick. Pop -nick. Cheese flavor, I never tried this before, it's new. Um, Jack and Jill potato chips, 
Cheddar and sour cream flavor. It's a little flat. I don't know if it's still good or not, but I'll take it. And the Oishi rib cracklings, salt and vinegar crackers. I have two of those. And then I also have potato chips, wasabi, wasabi flavor from Jack and Jill. I have a few of those. Veggie Reggie, that's cute. I never tried this before. So I'm looking forward to try that. Another potato chip, sour and cream. And then I have a few growers mixed nuts. So this is garlic flavored peanuts. Um, mixed nuts. Growers flavor, oriental flavor peanuts. And then I have another mixed nuts. So that's done. Another one, the next, the next one. So I saw um, it's Judy's life rave about this when she went to the Philippines. So I had my cousin find me some. So it's the Marty's Cracklin' Spicy Vinegar Flavor Chicharron. So it's vegetarian chicharron. It's pretty good. I tried it already. Um, I tried like two of the small ones of this and I'm so glad that there's still one huge one because I'm going to eat that after I film this video. And then we have Gimaras Finest Mango Bars. Mango bars are freaking amazing. I have it to try but yeah, I'm going to try it after I eat, I mean I film this video. I'm going to have some Biscotcha House Butterscotch. This is um... Local in Iloilo, so Iloilo local. Is that what you call it? Iloilo native, Iloilo original. Mm. So this culture house, it's um, bakery in Iloilo. So this one is Rosilio's, and then I also have some the real sweet Gimaras butterscotch. More of Marty's chicharron, yes. Um, and more Marty's chicharron. Oh, oh, that one's open. So this is Argy's butterscotch squares with cashews. That's what it looks like. Um, and then we have um, Oishi Pods pea snacks, um, vegetarian snacks. I never tried that one before either. So, oh, and last one, Rimby, my favorite. Okay, so, you guys, I grew up in the Philippines and I moved here when I was 13 in America. So, I've been here for like 15 years. I'm 28, yeah. 15 years and before when I used to live in the Philippines, me and my cousins, I grew up with my cousins. So, me and my cousins would always, always, um, get chichar um what do you call it chicharias so we would get um junk food from the change and we would get pop with it pop is soda and we would always have pop and um some kind of chiria and like one of those cheap breads from like like the teren teren and the it has like yellow inside pancho pancho i forgot what it's called but it's flat and it has like some filling inside and then the other one's teren teren, the other one's like ube and then there's another one that's like a bar if anyone knows what I'm talking about especially if you're from Iloilo please let me know what it is it's like ube bars? is it called ube bars? it's square like it's not square, it's rectangle and it has like coconut shavings on top of it so good oh god, so good you guys so, that concludes my haul. I said I was gonna include my Longchamp haul, I mean my Longchamp bag that I bought from when I went to, Japan, uh, not Japan, when I went to California with my mom. I bought a Longchamp bag, so let me show you. So you guys, this is the Longchamp bag that I got or my mom got me when we went to California that I said I would show you. This is the Longchamp um neo collection and this is black in the smallest size that they have and it does come with a strap 
So yeah, the strap attaches in these rings right here. So there's rings and the strap attaches to it and it's pretty small. So I would say it's comparable to the Speedy B 25, 30. It's like in between, it's an in-between size. So it's pretty good. That concludes my haul, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, thank you so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Give this videos a give this video a thumbs up if you've enjoyed it. And make sure you comment down below which tutorials you like and that you've tried and let me know which ones I should try next. So I'll see you on my next one and as always, namaste.